Welcome back, and I'm so glad you're here. I am the Emperor, and this is Dungeons 4 with Mission 8, the Big E.T. We have ascended the mountain in our last mission, talked to the Council of Snots, and asked what physical form might the ultimate evil take. Now, and they have suggested this little baby snot called Gorgu. Yes. The uh, pop culture references do not stop coming in Dungeons 4. So now we need to take care of this thing. The achievements here will be completed on any difficulty. We can do that. Keep him from getting hurt in the Big E.T. And feed Gorgu more heroes than necessary. All right. We might get a new skill. Undead minions explode when they die, dealing 25% of their total hit points and damage. Have at least 10 undog, uh, undead at the level of 5. Alright. So we are probably playing some undead this uh, mission on hard. Uh, we have two skills now because we've finally unlocked one. So let's go jump right in. I've taken time today. I've, I've proper taken time today to record this, so unless, unlike time the last few times, from the Council of Little I won't Snots. get into timing issues. And she was not alone, but also had Gorgu in tow, a being that would soon become the new absolute evil. In his honor, the Little Snots had already built him his own room. Hmm. I mean, that's kind of cute. A room with three entrances seems a lot like a death trap to me. Don't do it Three. yourself. But okay, enough of oh, that. Okay, yeah, sure. Babysitting this thing is really not my, well, thing. And anyway, it's cliche as hell that the main female character here is supposed to take care of a baby. What's next? Cooking someone dinner? Well... You're not serious, are you? In order for Gorgu to get stronger, he needed to be fed. But it was not overpriced food in jars he craved, but something with more substance. Heroes. Living heroes. As luck would have it, a few of the resident dwarves had just apprehended some thieves. Presumably, Gorgu would find them just as tasty as normal heroes if the jailbreak planning evil were to get his hands on them. Okay, I can kind of get on board with that after all. Okay, catch heroes and feed them to Gorgu. Coming right up. As if on cue, Tristan chose that very moment to appear on the scene. Talia, why are you here? Have you still not renounced evil? I have other matters to attend to. Men, seize them! Forward, men! Fight this abomination! The Alliance of Good All shall right. not fail! Well, not again! Heroes prepared to push towards the dungeon and would inevitably okay. encounter Gorgu. Apparently, Talia had to ensure not only his empowerment, but also okay. his safety. Oh, this babysitting is already getting on my nerves, and I don't even get paid for it. But okay, at least the heroes come straight here to get their asses kicked. Go ahead, whack them on the beans, smash their gourds, put radishes in their eyes. <laughs> in order to catch living heroes for Gorgu, a prison would need to be built. Immediately, Talia and the incarcerating evil set out to build such a room. Prison? Sounds like a sensible thing to do. But it's fun to watch some sorrowful characters languishing away there. <laughs> so what we're gonna do to start this out is we're gonna build pathways leading heroes from certain edges toward a single entry point as to lessen the load of uh, defenses we need to build. So bring them all in this direction and then we'll build a little maze around here as well to help us make this a little bit more palatable the for us. The evil scouts had discovered some undead that Tristan had captured. These necromancers and vampire queens would be a most welcome addition. Exactly! More cannon fodder for the front! I, I mean, strong support for our army. Go on! Can we even them. build from all Someone directions around here? 
Okay, we'll try. You have unearthed a new area in the dungeon. Yeah, that's gonna happen for a little bit. So we gotta be a little bit careful with building these. We can always reroute them later. But I don't want to end all of our potential walking areas. Okay, so... Oh no, mana balls. Let's pick up all that mana. And that up here as well. I'll have to deal with the mana balls in a moment. We'll just drop this somewhere where it doesn't belong for the moment, like here. Let's get our creatures, which we don't have too many of. Fight the mana balls. Pick up the gold as well. Where it... F ah, where it falls. Light blue is what we need. Okay, so there's some gold that we can then get. That's fine. Let's get some more creatures first. Maybe. Mm, I would like to have a, s a vampire queen. Because I think they heal people. Not sure. Temple room. Upgrade the snots. Always upgrade the snots first. And let's get more snots. Let's upgrade... Oh my god. I cannot be above this room. <laughs> oh my god. Let's see. Bone lords. Increase the lords armor by one. Duration of the screen by two seconds. Uh, let's upgrade our tanks first and buy some more tanks. Which we cannot. Because they are expensive as heck. Okay, so there's a little bit of an issue with this um, deviation here because there's a bunch of gold there. Which we'll need for other things. Alright, okay, so let's fill in some of these areas. Why can't I fill this in? They have access to the heart. Why can I not fill this in? What? Okay, that's weird. That's very weird. As long as they have access to the heart, and that is a continuous path there, I should be able to fill this in. I am able to fill this in, so they have to go walk through this. I'm allowed to fill this in. Okay, now I'm allowed to fill this in. Alright. That's what we want. And we're gonna fill this in as well. So everyone comes kind of this direction. Honestly, let's fill this in a little bit more just to be on the safe side. Should work, but you know. So then they have to go through this gauntlet thing here that we built. Which is fine by me. Maybe we can send... I think we can send these guys around here. Like this instead. And then we can fill this in, kinda. And we can get some gold excavation going there. And they would have to walk through lava. Okay, so this is filled in. This is filled in. Uh, Alright, now let's get to building some things, maybe. What do we need? There's more gold to be had. More gold to be had here, of course, as well. And we can, we can just excavate all that. That's no problem. We can just fill it in back later.
Let's increase our treasure chamber a little bit. And definitely... Now do we need to increase this? Not sure. Evilness, we're probably not going to need so much, but... Definitely increase the size of our graveyard if we're only going for undead. But I kind of don't want to only go for undead. I would also like to have some horde. Oh. Not sure. Let's face the first waves of heroes. See what happens. What are those yellow flags here? Ah, okay. That's the people we're supposed to capture. Brothers, the time has come. Now it is up to us to bring the realms of good to blossom once again. There in the underground, my evil stepsister has allied herself with the deviant creatures of chaos. The absolute okay. evil's last stand. Forward, men! Destroy this abomination once and for all! Tristan seemed to know how to motivate his men. They rushed towards the dungeon with a battle-hardened fervor. All right, creatures, we'll show my brother. Tear them to pieces, beat them to a pulp, and, uh, oh, don't hurt them too much, because we need them alive for Gorgu. Well, it doesn't really matter where they go right here. As long as they don't go straight, which I haven't filled in yet. There are Let's do that now. Dungeon. Okay, so these guys will have to walk the long way around, I think. But we'll watch it. This is pretty effective. Will they be healed, is the question. There's no healer there. Okay. Creatures are collecting their pay. That looks fine. I can fill this in now as well. No, no, I don't want to do that. Stop. Someday I'll loan the controls here. Let's increase the graveyard. Let's dig out all this. It's a nice little room for us, which we then can use for something. Okay, this worked nicely. So now we just kind of have to reinforce this bit. With more traps. There and these heroes have the it the absolute easiest. <coughs> Let's get our army ready here. Come on. So we fight them on the traps basically is what I'm thinking. And one of our banshees is immediately dead. Like, I feel undead are unreasonably weak, but I might be wrong. I think I'm just using them kind of not as intended, sort of. Ugh, yeah, that's what I wanted. Like, those tanks just aren't all that tanky. But that was good. That was decent. Talia and the merciless evil had repelled the first wave of attack. But the heroes would not stand idly by and would soon move in again. I sure hope so, because we're going to have to feed a lot more of them to Gorgu. 
Come on, bring it on, bring it on, like lambs to the slaughter. Gotta be a little bit careful with the <laughs> money here. So the way they pe put it like is like that. And we'll just put it the same way. So this way we only have to reinforce one side, which I appreciate a lot. Oh, we could get this gold as well. What do we need to build? We have the temple. We need a prison, which needs research, but we have zero evilness, so we have to go overground, which we can't really do because we have not a lot of creatures right now. Most of them are kind of dead. We could use somewhere to store mana, but we need research for that as well. Will he eat dead heroes is the question. No. And I also cannot pick up the dead hero anymore. Ah, there we go. So can throw that into the temple thing, in the sacrificial pit. So our undead are almost good again. We have a little bit of evilness. A tiny fraction, a sliver. But we need far more. And far more gold too. We might want to put a door, but we haven't researched that yet. So let's put a door here. That's the only way they can come from anymore. So that's fine, I'd say. What's going on here? There's a spider. Okay. I don't care about that. Let's go to the overworld a little bit. This time intentionally. And Ding dong, it's payday. Kick some people in the shins. Okay, very good. Like to take care of a hero settlement. If we can... So the priestesses are a bit of a problem because we have to basically walk our whole army into the enemy army. Which isn't great for positioning. But it is actually great for positioning because then the enemy is kind of stuck between all of our AOE attacks. Let's take that hero camp. Maybe they attack us, but we'll see. What is that? Oh, another unicorn. Very good. Those give a lot of evilness. Which we should like to have. Once again, many heroes gathered to attack the dungeon. Let's try this. Come on, get the priestess. Because not getting the priestess is also the bad choice, really. Step out a little. Okay, we didn't lose anyone. So we can go back down here. It's kind of convenient for us as well. I don't like that they keep coming on this Enemies one. Have entered the dungeon. But alright. Okay. Can we research the prison? Now. Not enough evilness. Do we spend it on something else? Snots maybe? Or improve our troops here? I think we should increase 
their resilience. What does this do? Sacrificial pit increases per tile and then it produces automatically. Well, we'll see. Alright, so so far... Traps are doing fine enough work. I want a bigger workshop though. Or rather, I want another thing that produces things here. Very least. Let's quarry out this gold here. See where it leads us. And we definitely need some more undead creatures. But I wanted to unlock something else first. These are all very, very expensive. We have to buy the ones we have. So let's get some more Bone Lords. More Bone Lords than Banshees. We need more tanks than anything. Alright! Okay, so only the gold level enemy has survived. Let's send these guys here to take care of it. Maybe someone dies. That one Bone Lord is kind of almost dead. The okay, they managed. Very good. So I'll just kick them into their, um, their home here. Right, so these come from here. Obviously, I could build traps everywhere. But I'd rather build traps in certain directions. Oh, very good. There's more gold for us. So that's going to be another treasure chamber right there. I'd rather concentrate the traps in one spot. They are expensive enough as it is. Could do this. Let's do this. Not sure why or what it's good for, but we will. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Okay, we could... Let's see, we could loop them around like this. Make it even longer. Fits exactly. Sort of. I will spend way, way, way too much time on building this contraption here looping the enemies around and then I will complain about how long these missions are that's exactly what's gonna Ding happen dong, mark my it. words will I be able to get around there I don't think so so let's deviate a little bit like this so we can have a bit of a bigger room here Just lengthening these to get some more uh, traps in there. Okay, looks like only the gold level heroes kind of make it through. Well, the point is like we loop them around like this. So they go through here and then through all there. You know? That's what I'm thinking here. But we definitely will need more traps, more chests to keep the traps going. A gold vein is almost exhausted. Good thing we found more. Okay, let's get our army in here so they can get some experience killing these guys. And we will want to fill this in once this is excavated. Another hero attack 
broke uselessly on the defensive evil's dungeon. It sure did. So we can go into the overworld again. I'm not sure why I'm going through the top portal. Uh, I want to try the unicorn at least. Can we even get there from here? Yes. Oh, God. God. Come on, everyone. Please. You have please group up a properly. New area in the dungeon. Ah, we don't like that. Nope. You get nothing. Do they attack snots? That's the question. No, they actually don't do anything. As long as they don't find mana, they're, they're kind of okay. Not that much of a problem. Okay, are we capable of dealing with the unicorn? I have my doubts. I have some severe doubts about that. I mean, if I play like that, we don't. <laughs> Everyone step to the side. Still caught him. Off. We'll do some micromanagement here. Will we kill it before it runs? Nope. <laughs> it was a gamble. It was a gamble. Calculated risk. With bad calculations. Oh, no, 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 no. We're definitely not killing it before it does this. What's this? Alright, now we have more evilness than we can use. Oh, wait, 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 no. Um, we'll just do the research now for the prison first, and the vampire queen second, and then the snots. Always upgrade the snots. So now we picked up the evilness, and we can go bring everyone back home. Oh no, the mana balls found our mana stores. <laughs> Silly little creatures. It's payday. We'll put them here instead. And we'll fill this in now. And we'll also fill this in. So they have to walk. Big maze. No, 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 I don't want to do that. Okay, do we have our troops? Yes. So we can now go fight the mana boars, sort of. Let's increase the size of our temple a little bit. And let's add some doors, shall we? And now we need a prison. This will be our prison, I think. Several heroes had gathered together and were making their way to the dungeon. Definitely needs a door. Can't have a prison without a door. That don't work. I don't think anyone is going to go here, so doesn't really matter what we put there. The newly built prison gleamed and sparkled. Or normally would have. But the little snods had just cobbled it together out of old materials. Still, it would serve its purpose and keep living heroes captive. These could then be fed to Gorgus using the Hand of Terror. The ingenious evil surely knew that it was only a matter of time before heroes would descend upon Gorgu. 
wisely. It cranked up workshop production in order to be able to set traps. It oh, surely did. I knew that. By all means. Onward, little snots. Work faster. Of course, all of our creatures have to walk really, really far as well, with how we built this. Why are you taking down our very cool walls, little snots? So this, it might look pointless, but this is a good spot, honestly, to put our creatures. That's not why I built it. I built it without thinking first. But it really truly is. Should probably put a slow here so there's a bigger chance of people falling in there. And if we close this here, if we close this, We can. What? Then we can ex unearth all that. That's fine. Enemies have entered the dungeon. They sure have. And I realize that me saying they sure have is about as repetitive as everything that happens in the game, <laughs> which I keep criticizing. Have we got our first prisoners? Not yet. No. Surely. A gold vein has been mined out. Not great. Not too bad. Let me guess, we're gonna find something digging here. Well, some more gold. Oh, lots of gold. All right, time for some experience on our troops. I mean, these are all pretty down already, so taking them apart now is not that problematic. Just a few more gold heroes left. No, no, take care of this guy as well. And then we go up to the overworld again. There is another unicorn. Oh, no, no, crystal golden. Okay. Talia and the murderous evil had repelled an attack by the heroes with no great effort. We sure had. Let's go out this side. need to upgrade honestly we can upgrade this that way we can have more creatures it doesn't have to be undead or horde creatures rather okay we don't have money we have everything just not money Okay, let's try and take out another camp. Doesn't really matter who we kill here. A pathetic hero languished in prison. The horrible evil could feed him to Gorgu. Okay, let's see if this works. The baby feeding evil had thrown Gorgu his first hero. 
the young little snot gleefully set about soaking up its soul energy. Oh, the little one is so cute. Now a little pup, and then... Let us rain death and destruction upon the humans! <laughs> okay. Tanya's certainty of victory seemed somewhat premature, for Gorgu's hunger was far from satisfied. It would take many more heroes before he would reach his full strength. Let's keep looking for some more hero camps. We need that evilness. I think I'd go for this? Where is that even? Like, I don't see anything. Yep, this villager will survive. I have ordained it. That's one. Oh. Okay, that's just cheap. The thing is over there. Okay, I'll send one specifically to kill her. But we did lose some people here. Our tanks are down. Let's go down here? I don't quite know where that is. The here, little evil lad. Tossed a hero into Gorgu's chambers. Oh god, okay, no. Not good, potentially. Not sure if we're strong enough to fight this. A vampire queen joined the undead evil. Her healing powers were captivating. Wonderful. Okay, where are we even? Alright, okay, that's good. There's a diamond vein. Once again, let's many try and take care of this. The dungeon. Brought in some little vampire queens to help with the healing, maybe? I like that every undead has their own little helper thing that they can summon. Vampires have this little imp type creature. So that's pretty cool. Payday. Creatures are collecting their pay. Definitely need to build a treasure chamber here. Okay, everyone. I don't know if we have enough people for this or if this was foolish. I mean, the AoE is fairly strong, yeah? And I don't see healers here on the enemy side, so maybe. But we might have to pull the plug. Nah, we have to pull the plug. That's We don't have enough. Not powerful enough for this. Can't pick these up yet. Shame. What is this? Necrodancicon. Hey, the undead satisfied they need to dance and generate light in the process. Okay. Our faction research is too low, though. We need to get the snots... ...saved. In a way where they enemies are no longer seen as an dungeon. enemy. That's what we need to do. 
And we need to take care of these people here. What? A dwarven base has been expanded? What does that mean? Doesn't look very expanded to me. Does that mean they got more people? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, they're re regaining the rooms and regaining the rooms. Oh, uh. Okay. Can I pick up my dead creatures here? Oh, that's, that's very weird. Um, that is very weird. That controls strangely. Okay, these are just, I think, enemy heroes. So if we can't take them immediately, are in the dungeon. that's a problem. But if we excavate in from this end, that's okay, I would say. So now we could go this way. Newly hard on that start out with level one heroes. Defeated on the overworld, they teleported to the graveyard after 10 seconds. That's okay. We'll take that. So now we should be able to burrow in this end. We could go this way, of course, but that opens up another entryway, which we could then fill in if we build that way. We'll have to see. Okay, everyone. Your gold vein is nearly exhausted. Let's kill these fools. Here, please regenerate a little bit. I should like to have another vampire queen, but we're not really quite there financially, economically. I'll fill this in a little bit more. I feel safer if it's not just one little thing there. A hero had been tossed into Gorgu's chambers. It sure had been. A hero disappeared into Gorgu's chambers. A hero had been tossed into Gorgu's chambers. Okay, so we have to do this 250 times. Is he gonna say that 250 times? Is this what I'm learning here? Is this correct? Is my assessment proper? Another hero attack broke uselessly on the defensive evil's dungeon. Okay, um, out we go again. And we'll go through this entrance. And we'll go here in the hopes of not running into anyone. And then we'll try and take out the dwarves again. I should think and we can increase the size of our graveyard some more Payday. get some money in the process these guys should die there's always this one spider that spawns there okay everyone let's go down attack the enemy again Let's take care of those dwarves down there. Ah. That was entirely unnecessarily what I just did. I mean, walking them around. I could have just picked them up and dropped them down here. <laughs> oh, yeah. Live and learn. Okay, we have a few dead creatures sitting around there. Nope, not temple graveyard. So. 
Can we win it this time? I say we might just be able to. Looks much better than before. Now we bury in here. And also immediately build our way over here. A pathetic hero languished in prison. The horrible evil could feed him to Gorgu. Yeah, yeah. They could. The absolute evil had tossed a hero into Gorgu's chambers. Okay, we did manage it, sort of. The dwarf destroying evil had defeated the dwarven jailers and thus gained access to their secret prison. Mm hmm. Let's try and pick up our undead from the carnage here. Okay, these are some of ours. Can I afford someone else? Yes, another vampire queen. So what? Okay, we can pick these up now. Basically. Can I just drop these wholesale into his room like this? A hero disappeared into Gorgu's chamber. Oh boy, okay, that was a big munch. <laughs> can I pick them up like this? Yes, I can. That is much more sensible. Gorgu seemed reasonably satisfied. Talia and the lamb gravy seeking evil have probably satisfied the little one over a fifth of his hunger. The first step had been taken. <laughs> that was ridiculously easy. Open wide, Gorgu. Here comes the next hero. So now we can fill this in basically. And we can just build our way down here and fill this in and then we're pretty good on where these enemies could go if they ever choose to come this way. Let's pick up some evilness and some more of it. Because for each of these the snots have kind of got a walk. Enemies are in the dungeon. Wrong place. But this here. Okay, I'm not too fussed about these enemies in the dungeon. That's okay. Might want to build another pushy thing there. Why not? Alright, we're almost through here, meaning we can fill this in. So we shall, and then we can start working on the diamond vein. Have that be a thing. Payday! Creatures are collecting their pay. has been unearthed in the dungeon. All right, what is this? The creature makes all targets hit 50% perk potion level Enemies 1. Okay, we're going to give that to Talia. Dungeon. Can we? No. What do we give this to? This guy? Let's give it to one of our vampire queens. Did that work? I don't know. Maybe. Uh, 
There's some more gold there. We'll just mine that out. Having a diamond vein is, of course, a good thing for us. So we have some guaranteed income for a little while longer. Alright. We need gold more than anything else. Do, do heroes only get deactivated, let's say, catchable if they die to a trap? There's more experience points for us waiting here. And our snots keep dying. We need that upgrade. That's need, that needs to be our next investment. That the enemies doesn't... Don't see snots as uh, dangerous and ignore them. That's what we need. Okay, more and more enemies coming in. Our creatures are slowly being destroyed. I shall think we're gonna make that. These are all pretty dead. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. Immediately three of them healed over. Completely mined out a gold vein. Am they now? Talia and the perfidious evil had easily repelled another attack by the heroes. Let's go, buddy. I mean I I wouldn't say that was easily. Oh no. I don't want the snot. I wanted to try and grab one of our people dying. So maybe we catch the evilness then. Sounds a little bit like an STD. Let's catch us some evilness. Okay, we will help our creatures move quicker through the dungeon. There's really no point in having them walk all around as we would our enemies. Where did we put these now? I don't remember in which room I threw the mana to keep it away from the mana balls. Ah, there, randomly, nowhere. Okay, folk. The absolute Monch. evil had tossed a hero into Gorgu's chambers. So I see a problem. Oh boy. Oh, 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 okay. Ooh. What's flying about there? I see a problem with our setup. The problem being all the snots doing all the things, running all around. And then kind of getting, having to walk through our stuff as well. But I can't really speed it up. If I want the enemies to have to go through the gauntlet, the snots have to as well. It's kind of what it is. A hero disappeared into Gorgu's chambers. Ooh. Ding dong! It's payday! So we're being attacked soon again. But I'm thinking of going to the overworld. Through this portal. How are our creatures? Fine-ish. One of them is still in need of some healing. But she's getting there. Snots are slowly clearing it, this out. Can I deliver these? No, I don't think so. I mean, to the traps that I can deliver them, that, that is clear. Is there like one little spider nest right behind that wall? I think that's what's happening. Must be.
No one has ever come from this end so far. Huh. Several heroes had gathered together and were making they their are. way to the dungeon. The absolute sure evil have. had tossed a hero into Gorgu's chambers. I think we'll just go to the overworld now. Where are we at? Everyone's sealed up. Okay, very good. So we'll go down here. Get everyone. Set a new short command here. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Look how squishy they are. It's Can they not progress to a higher level? Are they limited? Okay, so now the snot should be ignored. Well, level 4 snots. Should be ignored, so that's good. So this guy here can walk through them without having any trouble. Very good. The lower level ones cannot. That helps us. Enemies have entered the dungeon. They sh might have. Let's kill all them sheeps. I think it gives us some evilness. Okay, tiny bit. And let's go through here to there. Oh, is the unicorn back again? Very good. And spending all my money on more traps, of course. Can't help myself. Unsupervised minions managed. We lost a vampire queen, though. The necromantic evil welcomed a necromancer into its ranks. These all undead right. mages could rain powerful magic upon their enemies once it was researched. A pathetic hero languished in prison. The horrible evil could feed him to Gorgu. The decent evil had rescued the necromancers from their plight. These willingly joined the army of absolute evil. Necromancers were good ranged fighters. What was truly impressive, however, was the skill allowing them to create a blight mist, which could heal and strengthen undead in its area of effect, causing minions to explode upon death and weaken enemies. Enemies have entered the dungeon. Okay, um... Let's research something. If we just could. We don't need gobbler farms. It's payday. A hero had been cast into Gorgu's chambers. Kinda don't want to go back down with the evil laying around here. Like it's not gonna go away, but Come on, buddy. You're my only hope here. Okay, so a lot of them are dying here as well. So the snots have to run very, very far. 
Let's give them a little bit of a boost to help with their tasks. Okay, we have to go back down. There are heroes now that kind of went around my defenses. See, this one is making it pretty far. That marksman. Level 6 knots are where we need to be. Our troops will soon be back. Will it be soon enough though? Because we might have damage to Grogu, which is an achievement here. There is a door that she has to kill first. Okay, our creatures are coming in. So we can put them here and end her life before she gets in there, I hope. Yep. Okay, that, that was a little bit too close for comfort. I think we'll just attack it head on. I'm considering now removing some of these traps here so we have less walking. I think we'll do that. I think we'll do that. We'll just destroy these traps here. They do give us money back, so... I like these, so we'll keep them. Just for the fun bit. But we need to keep in mind the walking distances. So we'll remove all the entry traps that were built by the dungeon itself. Because they don't help us. I mean, they help us, but making certain things a little bit less sensible than they should be. Are there traps here as well? Now these we leave because I find them funny. did we lose? A vampire queen? Let's get another one of those. And should we increase our evilness chamber? I mean, we could just research it, but... Okay, I want this place. <clears throat> Excuse me. And maybe we can upgrade... Banshee minion attack lowers cold resistance by another 50%. It's pretty good, I assume. This is pretty good, but we want this more than anything. Faction research too low. So let's get this. Gives us more snots to go with anyhow. Another hero attack broke uselessly on the defensive evil's dungeon. Is that another spider here? Pick up the evilness. And now we need to build this out a little bit, but of course still this will cost us a lot of money. Of which we have very little to begin with. Okay, what room do we have to build that thing in? Just make another one, like here. There's some gold here to be had. So we'll dig in here and get the dance hall going for, for our undead. It's right next to where they live anyway. Now I should like to go to the overworld again. And we will go this route. We're fine on health. Payday. I will go this way because there's another hero camp there. A hero died in prison 
The forgetful evil had left him there instead of feeding him to Gorgu, most Fine. regrettable. A hero disappeared into Gorgu's chambers. Okay, so now that we have the Necromancers, there's something attacking the back line of the enemy. That's kind of nice. That's my main problem with the Undead Army. That they really tend to not do that. And we're absolutely locked on level 3. That's not good. There's another dwarven area. The underground opened up in front of the delighted evil's army. I am not too delighted, I must say. There's even more things to take care of. Pick up that evil. What's here? this place. I mean, if we go down there now, we can at least fight in a way where we can then drop down to here, and there's some gold veins, sadly. There's no diamonds here. But that's okay. So if we... Okay, let's just do it. We'll just go down here, fight our way a little bit in, and then we'll see how we deal with it. Once again, many heroes gathered to attack the dungeon. Let them. They're not gonna get through. Sp shows you the undead... what? Where? Shows your undead creatures maximum level. It's four. Why don't we have level four creatures, really? <coughs> or almost none, anyway. Okay, there's some. They just don't have enough experience. It's true. The absolute evil had tossed a hero into Gorgu's chambers. Increase the range of the Bone Lord's minions, yeah. Can I upgrade this? Yes, I just don't have the gold. Have we lost anyone? Resurrected evil's undead creatures I don't think. I've previously seen a video called Thruller or something like that, and have been in dark fever ever since. Higher level undead demanded a Necrodancian where they could indulge their latest obsession. Okay, so no research, we have to build the Necrodancian. For level 4 undead. We could go into research for our horde and then unlock the arena and slowly go that route. The Necrodancian had been built. Undead flocked by to swing their bony hips there. Those undead who no longer had hip bones just stood on the sidelines, swaying back and forth <laughs> in time to the music. The jailbreak preparing evil had eliminated a prison's dwarven guards. The prisoners now belonged to it alone. A hero disappeared into Gorgu's chambers. Big Munch. Biggest munch of them all. Okay. So we'll just... Oh. There is a direct line for our dungeon. Okay, then. What am I picking up? Are these dead? I don't know. We're just going to keep picking them up. I think they're dead. Enemies have entered oh. the dungeon. 
where are they going? A pathetic hero languished in prison. The horrible right here is where they're going. Could feed him to Gorgu. Payday. Okay, that's a bit of a problem. <coughs> it's not what we want at all. So we have to fill this up. ASAP. Not quite sure how that happened. Or rather how I let it happen. Let's be honest. It's my fault for sure. Gorgu's stomach was already almost half full. The budding celebrity chef evil seemed very pleased with itself. Surprising, seeing as all these heroes were served raw. Hey, what about me? I'm very satisfied myself. Maybe we'll stuff an apple in the next one's mouth. <laughs> Let's pick up that evil that's lying around here. Spare us not some work. Okay, now we can do some research. Let's get them snots up. One more. More snots. More evil, more everything. If we just carry those dead heroes for them. I mean, if they're dead, I don't know. We'll just the throw them in here. So he can eat the ones chance. that aren't actually dead. And all the ones that are dead can just be brought to the prison, uh, to the to the graveyard from there. It's pretty fine by me. A hero had been tossed into Gorgu's chambers. All right. So the way I want to do this... Can I even do it the way I want to do this? No one came through here yet, but I'm not taking that chance, really. Mm. The absolute evil had tossed a hero into Gorgu's chambers. Okay, why can't I pick up more? It's a bunch. A hero had been tossed into Gorgu's chambers. So all these eaten straight away. Let's get our little army together. And venture. Do we go to the overworld or do we attack here? How's that marksman doing? A little bit too good. So we'll attack here. A hero disappeared into Gorgu's chambers. Gotta give the snot some room to dig. Oh, we don't have enough evilness. Is the big evil being? Yep, that's still there. Whoop. So now they can teleport to jobs. That should help us. Uh, I think... I would like to increase this so they can get level 5. Right now, I don't think they can. Okay, everyone's fine. So we venture out once more to here. Might just run into heroes. But we're also going to pick up some more undead allies, it appears, up there. 
Now the question is, if we destroy all the hero camps, will there no more heroes be coming to us? Talia and the perfidious evil had easily repelled another attack by the heroes. Your creatures have destroyed a cage. this we just destroyed the hero building for us very good that's what we like to hear let's check up around here if there's more did we forget okay oh we've got a cage no 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 that will not do hello marksman the absolute evil had tossed a hero into gorgu's chambers is there more evilness laying around here somewhere? No, I was not. So I've already taken care of The zombie-like evil had freed all the captured undead, making his army even more powerful. This deserved a fanfare. But since the budget for sound effects has already been used up, I will have to do the honors instead. Do do. A hero had been tossed into Gorgu's chambers. I'll take that. That's that's a good enough sound effect for me. Ah, oh, look at them leveling up, little buddies. So we got them working tirelessly here. We walked straight through enemies because that's what I keep doing. But this time it doesn't look like we were off worse for the wear. Let's attack these enemies together, though. How about it? So the healing is slowly getting to a point where it's pretty darn good. Where I don't need to worry about losing everyone again. I don't quite think that these fortresses and encampments are actually contributing to how many heroes are attacking as part of the mission. I think that's an entirely different thing. And we need to clear out these spiders there. That irritates me that they exist. I mean, one way to deal with healing is just dealing way, way more damage than healing is coming in, you know? Several heroes had gathered together and were making their way to the dungeon. Let's have at least someone attack the priestess because she's actually a gold one, so she can. She can actually out heal us. Which is a little bit crazy. But there you go. High level heroes. Are just an entirely different matter. So we can dig this way. Free up some more real estate for us as well on the way. And we are full up with evilness again. So let's push this thing. Let's give them a second level. Extra healing. Capacity per tile. We don't really need that. Newly hired undead. Start out with a minimum of level of one. Okay. I think I want to go this route. Um, but getting to the point where undead are allowed is going to be a bit of a tough number. 
But at least we can pick up the evilness now. And we Enemies might just have entered the dungeon. go visit the unicorn again. Get some more evilness out of it. Looking at our dungeon, I'm... I'm okay, like, there's no way for them to get in unless they go all the way around. So we needn't worry about this. Faction research up. Evilness is our problem. So let's take care of that lovely, lovely unicorn. Such a cutie. Everyone. Uh... Nope. Step back. Okay, now we can fight for a moment. Off, everyone, off. Nope. Just stay away. Little creature triggered it. It's payday. Look at that, a payday we can actually afford. That's rare. Out of the way. Okay, didn't work. Not well enough anyway. Can we kill it before it does this? No. Again. Gambling and failing. Take it from me, kids. Gambling isn't worth it. Alright, there's more evilness laying around there that we can take, I think. Okay, so now Undead can train downstairs. Very good. And now we can send everyone back home. And we'll take Your that entrance. In the dungeon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And it's kind of where they're supposed to be. Let's upgrade these guys. Oh. Healing by Vampire Queen is increased by 50%. Okay, thanks. Definitely will take that. And... Okay, I wanted to excavate this into the spider lair. Which is definitely going to be a problem. But this is where we will build our arena. Basically this whole place here. A gold vein is almost exhausted. Let's drop our creatures down here. That's not all of them. No. Okay, some of them just reach earlier than others. It's very odd. Your little snots have dug up a spider. Yep. They sure have. And mana balls are also coming. Of course they are. So everyone is down. Let's go take care of the spider and the mana pools and everything. So we'll have to fill this in. Later. I kind of want to see the undead dance. So our tanks should be sufficiently tanky now. I'm looking for more creatures because some of them are just kind of walking away now. I will have to deal with these. Our traps ain't powerful enough yet. Listen. Listen. You gotta come fight. 
Can't win this without you. Might have to abandon the battle against the spiders. Yeah. We shall. We'll deal with these guys first. Who are curiously turning around. And we'll come back for the spiders a little bit later. First we take care of all these fools. Very good, we had a healer up front, which we like, of course. Okay, maybe we stop farming the gold vein here. How about that? A pathetic hero languished in prison. The horrible evil could feed him to Gorgu. I'm not horrible. I'm very delightful. The absolute evil had tossed a hero into Gorgu's chambers. Okay, we have a bunch of level 5 undead now. That's pretty cool. Let's throw them in here. Ding dong, it's payday. Nope, definitely not. I just want to pick up the evil. Thank you. Okay, apparently I picked up that hero. Evil. Thank you. Talia and the murderous evil had repelled an attack by the heroes with no great effort. Alright, back to the spiders. Let's pick up the evil bits that are lying around here. So our snots don't have to. Spare them a little bit of work. Let's pick up all these fools here. I like that it at least only summons the type of thing you already have in your hand, so you don't accidentally hoover up all your snots along there. Gorgu slowly developed a little paunch, but the diet of only heroes obviously seemed to agree with him. At least he was accumulating lots of soul energy. Ugh, look. That last hero had munched enough garlic to take out all the vampires in all of the kingdoms. But whatever. Keep it up, Gorgu. Soon what? you'll be a great and powerful dungeon lord. And you'll be It's just an assassin standing around there. Useful. Okay. That was curious. Look at all these prisoners. We need to be a little bit careful. We have to overfeed him. A hero had been so once we reach like 250 or something, or 220 or what, we need to actually start counting calories here. The absolute evil had tossed a hero into Gorgu's chambers. Okay, so let me build that training place. A little bit of it anyway. And now let's fill in this wall and this wall. See how they teleport here. I love it. Cute little buggers. Let's fill in this. Let's start working on that. Also excavate this gold. All the rest we don't really care about. We're just gonna fill it in here. And then we can start building this out a bit more. That's an expensive build, but sometimes you have to go above and beyond for your creatures. has been mined out.
Once again, a golden portal suddenly opened in the dungeon. If Tanya okay. and the overrun evil failed to destroy it, heroes would inevitably use it to enter the dungeon. What? But all my lovingly placed traps and defense plans. But that's not I bad. I drew them in using colored pencils. That's okay. Oh, I don't care. Whatever. Go on, creatures. Destroy those magical It's actually good portals. for us. Just hammer on them with your weapons. That'll destroy them. That's how it always worked before. On the other hand, it still needed heroes to feed Gorgu. So maybe yeah. those portals weren't all bad for Tanya after all. Now my main issue is getting this gold here. I mean, if we if we open this up again, we can close this and we can mine it out like that. The main thing I wanted them to walk around this way, so they went through the lava. But I don't. That doesn't really matter much. Comparatively. So. A hero had been cast into Gorgu's chambers. Let's see. Yeah, I think. I think we'll open this up again. So we can close this and that. And then we can start getting this gold here. No trouble. So we'll fill in this. Uh, no. We have to wait. And... In your dungeon. Payday. Well, do we have to wait, really? Oh, that's fine. Anyone dancing yet? A gold vein has been mined out. All right. Come on, boys. Don't languish. Let's get going here. I mean, there's several gold veins I would like to get my hands on, still. We gotta be a little bit sneaky, a little bit crafty here. Okay, so now we can fill this here in. And this as well. And we can dig through here for once. The Enemies filling in is the next the thing dungeon. that needs to happen. Yeah, yeah, they're already immediately turning back. See, <coughs> there's a better spot for them to come. <coughs> we'll just fight them here. Very, very suboptimal, but... We cannot have everything. As long as someone comes fill this in, we'll be fine. Let's have some surprise party here. No, 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 don't, don't do that. And can someone please fill this in? No, these are not... Why are these yellow? Why are they not blue? Why can't we fill this in? Oh no, blue means someone is working on it. Oh, you. Do this. Okay, fine, don't do this then. Okay, so we have half our army fight there. That's really not what I wanted. Someone needs to fill this in or are we going to have a... Well, we're not going to have a problem, but it's not how I want it. Which should equate to a problem for all our creatures.
Look at all that healing coming in. That's great. Let's get more of these guys. Could someone Ogle please fill this in? By heroes who fought him, Talia had to do something about it. What? The absolute what? The hero into Gorgu's chambers. Oh no, they walked around. Okay, we failed that achievement. Ah, Another what a shame. Broke One and a half hour. Dungeon. Oh man, that hurts. That hurts a little bit. But I'm not going to restart anything for this. No, thank you. If these missions weren't so long. That's really old. If they just weren't so long. Obviously, we all want games that have a lot of content going. But... At some point, it becomes a question of do they respect your time. And then again, most people probably wouldn't just record all in one going and uh, do that. Most people would just play and then save and restart. So it's perfectly fine there. I need to stop complaining about this. So it's, it's a terribly minor complaint. But this here isn't. Because they can just waltz in here because our snots are not getting that thing done. Which is weird because they got the other side perfectly quickly. I don't know. Well, Gorgu was almost completely sated. He didn't need much more to reach his full potential. All right, let's move on to the desserts. Hot Raspberry Hero, Hero Brule, and oh, what the hell, there's just more normal heroes from the dungeon. Go on, keep on munching. It's your patriotic contribution to the evil empire. Hey, try and get your payday there. There's really nothing here. But this irks me. Far more than it should. Why do they not build that? Why do they prioritize other tasks? They should. The absolute evil had tossed a hero into Gorgu's chambers. So where are we? 226. A hero disappeared into Gorgu's chambers. Come on, build this, please. Sometimes these end up in these weird prisons. Not sure why. A hero had been tossed into Gorgu's chambers. Okay, come on. Someone needs so to have some time to deal with this now. In the dungeon. <sighs> okay, I, I probably can't even fill up the original anymore. Because no one's going to pick up that task. And we have all the snots we can have. Well, no, we th there's still some more to get. Where's the other port? <coughs> Don't see it on the map. Enemies are in the dungeon. Oh, I think I know why they're not filling it up. Because this bit here isn't open. That's why they're not filling it up. Okay, fine. It's my mistake once again. Because the enemies need to have a route. They can't not have not a route. It's disallowed. Where? Oh, okay, this... Okay, so now they're now they're putting it down. Ay ay ay. Ignorance is not always bliss. Sometimes it just messes with you. So now that's sorted. Let's get our people in here. What portal though? Okay. I'm 
and just pick up this one single nonsensical warrior and all these people here. So 2031. Hero disappeared into Gorgu's 41. Okay, we need to be, now we need to get deliberate about feeding him. Destroy good being. Destroy good being. Yeah, okay, that's just what we get there. So we can do this as often as we need to get more evilness, basically. As they do respawn. So this is just a maximum of three. And all of these are dead anyway. Might as well bring them down to the graveyard. Okay, we could help them in one way. We could make a door here. And they don't have to walk all the way around here. They can just go that way. And no one ever came to train here. Good work. Okay, how many do we have? Two, four, six, eight... 10. Ding dong, it's payday. So now we have 13 on the hand or something. So if we drop that in, that should be fine, no? Gorgu was reasonably sated. Theoretically, all it could okay, do okay. now was initiate his transformation. Or it could so we... Gorgu even more to make him a even more powerful oh that almost sounds like some kind of achievement i'll just feed him in some more you bet i'm in go gorgu dig in like it's taco tuesday this so you don't really have to worry about now. that that's good men get ready for a continuous assault on the dungeon we will not waver we will not give up victory will be ours once again a portal opened in the dungeon where Okay, it's back there again. I mean, we could build a prison here and just have it be a prison. Or right there, you know. Could. Maybe even should. I mean, we haven't built have any the dungeon. traps here, really, so... Might as well turn this into a prison. Even less walking for our little lads. There's a whole lot more here. Shoop, 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 shoop. A hero had been cast into Gorgu's chambers. Mm. That's that's not a great prison. <laughs> it's a pretty bad prison. Okay, they're not even bringing them there, but it might not be because. They don't want to bring it there, but because Elements their path has been set before the, the new prison was built. That could be it. You never know. So let's recruit us some more creatures, maybe. Maybe they go train immediately. If we spawn them Another here. Portal opened in the dungeon. I wish it were a little bit easier to see the... Okay. That's a problem.
That is a bit of a problem. All the portals were fine up until this one. And we're losing creatures? Maybe. Alright, so now they're putting them here. Or one. A hero disappeared into Gorgu's chambers. Bit of a problem. The absolute evil had tossed a hero into Gorgu's chambers. They sure had. Okay, so these are now attacking this door, unsurprisingly. Let's go kill him. Not the best idea had in this mission. I wonder what this does. Something truly unnatural made its way up from the depths of Gorgu's cute little body. A sound that made the do-gooders freeze in shock. Ugh, don't forget the fetid <laughs> smell at the end. That's really nasty. Okay. But hey, now we know. We knock some heroes out for a bit. Forward, creatures! Get them! Beat them up! And don't forget to hold your noses. I think we've fed him fair enough, so... Once again, portal opened in the dungeon. Let's go do this. Come Let's finish on, this. Nick. Get yourselves together and finally put an end to that thing! <laughs> Gorgu let out a deafening, satisfied belch that sent the remaining heroes fleeing. <laughs> Getting the absolute evil back on its feet was a lot easier than I thought. As I see it, the campaign won't be needing the promised 20 levels, but can actually end after the next map. Wonderful. Then I can treat myself to a nice relaxing bath in unicorn blood. Tanya seemed very certain of victory, perhaps too certain of victory. It was negligent to believe that this story would already come to an end after such a brief intermezzo. We got only one achievement. I'm a little bit confused because I would say we definitely fed him more than needed. So we got below that threshold. There was something else. Uh, that, yeah, okay. One hour and a half in, we kind of lost that plot, sadly. But this one, I don't understand. All right. Doesn't really matter. We got the kamikaze minion thingy. So that's lovely. Uh, improve, improving our undead creatures for the future. As we like to do so. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Leave a comment. Maybe if you have some have to say something. Uh, leave a subscription if you haven't already. Check out the Twitch as well. Where we stream thrice a week. Sometimes more. And I hope to see you around the next one. Thank you very much. Until then, bye-bye.